Hello everybody, the infamous Tony here, and welcome back to Let's Play Yume Nikki. I had fun trying to figure out what was going on the last time that we played this lovely title. I uh, ended up not being able to save, and come to find out that's actually a thing. It's um, She gets a crick in her neck, and when she... Okay. Anyway, she gets a crick in her neck, and she can't wake up or she when she wakes up and she can't save or play games or anything I, I don't know and apparently this is a very rare thing uh, one of you guys commented on it and said that it was like one in uh, some odd hundred chance of it actually happening and the fact that it happened to me twice was just even more rare so um, yeah that's the thing anyway so we're jumping right back into it I'm finally I went back to sleep and woke up again and she straightened out finally and I was actually able to get back to saving the game. So things are looking up. I love how it's daylight out. I had never seen it daylight until the first time that she had the crick in her neck. And it just it freaked me out a little bit. But anyway, we're going to jump right back in. And we're going to see what we can come across in this bizarre dream world uh, now. Um, I did learn that you can ride this little crazy thing around. Oh, 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 wait, hang on. There's a way to do this. Oh, well, anyway, there's apparently, you can ride the, uh, okay. You can ride the, uh, 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 desk chair around your room like a crazy person. All right, let's take all of these with me because you never know what you're going to need. So I know there were other things. These different effects do different things, and some of them just don't really do anything at all. Um, apparently, they're purely aesthetic. I think this was the world that we went into, but there's... Maybe this one's where we need to... Okay, we were already in there. We've been in there. Let's try the eyeball door. Because it looks perfectly 100% creepy as crap. Eyeballs. Hi, eyeball. Grabby hands. Hi, grabby hands. Do you hurt me if you grab me? No? Okay. Alright, 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 alright. I'm getting sidetracked. Let me remember the pattern that we've been using. Just go straight down until we find a thing. Um, and then go from there. I hope that works. There's an eyeball. There's a couple more eyeballs. There's eyeballs and grabby hands. Perfectly normal. This one's actually pretty... There's a leg. Are you what I need? No? No? This, this world's actually pretty big by comparison uh, to some of the other ones. Uh, I guess. It looks like it, anyway. Um, hi, hand. Could you lend me a hand, hand? No. Okay. So, anyway. Apologies if you hear screams in the background. Uh, the wife is watching horror films with a friend of hers. I decided I would take the opportunity to explore this weird world that I am in. So, let me get a little more comfortable. I have a long day at work, so there's there's need to be comfortable. Okay, let's see. Creepy hands, creepy hands. Okay. I hope I don't get lost. Hey, you're creepy as crap. What are you? There's a leg that's jumping around. No, you're not a thing? Okay. <laughs> this is perfectly normal. Just blood splatters on the ground. Hands and feet. Hi. How are you guys doing? Okay. <laughs> Right. About that. Hmm. I think this was the hand that I started at. 
Maybe. Let me see. Yes, okay, that was the hand that I started. So now I need to continue on further until I come across another thing that I can use as a reference. Cluster of eyeballs. Okay. Let's go. Hi. Okay. Things are just getting super awesome right now. Oh, oh, oh that's that's nice. Do you, do you do you do things? Oh, you kiss. The eyes don't do anything. Okay. Make kissy sounds. Lovely. Hi, creepy hands. Is that the cluster of eyeballs? Yes. Okay, that was the cluster of eyeballs. Well, not cluster. Couple of eyeballs. Okay, let's go this way. See what else we can find. Hi. Hello, Grabby Hand. How are you? I'm gonna go right this way. Okay. Couple more hands. Ooh, I just randomly started walking off in the high. You're actually a door. That's normal. Not. But I didn't find anything in the room with the stuff. Okay, whatever, we'll walk through this creepy... Ah! Skr! I think I scared the dog. What dog? likes right. Did I mention this game's getting weirder and weirder and weirder? Like, the first couple rooms were, you know, they were just borderline weird. This room is just getting really weird. Like, I don't even know where the... On a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being just kind of weird and 10 being really weird, this is a definite... world, but apparently it's not 
right in this immediate area. I love the lampposts, they really kind of trip me out a little bit, and the backgrounds are just really creepy. I haven't found anything in this room yet. Nothing, not a single thing, except for warps and different parts of the world that are just weirder than the part that I came from. And that was pretty weird. I mean, it was eyeballs and hands and Christmas tree. Okay. How do I get to the Christmas tree? I mean, not necessarily a Christmas tree. It's just a pine tree. There's a thing. What are you? Are you one of those things that freak out when I try to talk to you? Yeah, I think you are. Um. Okay. <laughs> this kid thinks it's hilarious. I have no idea why I'm suddenly been banished to a dock in the middle of whatever this is and I can't go anywhere. Nowhere. <sighs> well, I have no choice but to wake up. So, let's do that. That was so weird. So very weird. I have no idea what that was. Okay, well, anyway. You were in the middle of nowhere. What was that? that? was a loud thump. I think that was a world. So anyway, that's what that was. Anyway, I'm going to stop this video here. I just wanted to do a quick short one for you guys. So uh, there's that. I didn't find anything. So hopefully in the next one we'll actually find something else. I'm not going back in the eyeball room yet. Um, I probably should, but I'm going to skip over that and go to the next one. And we're going to see what we can come up with in the next room. Maybe we can find something that we can actually use. Maybe. So anyway, uh, the name of the game is Yumi Nikki. If you guys are enjoying what you're watching so far, be sure to click on the link in the description below to try the game out for yourself. Also, don't forget to follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and click on the like button for me if uh, you guys enjoyed watching this video. Sorry I didn't find anything, but hey, there's always tomorrow. Anyway, also, I found out that this game is actually probably going to be very, 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 very long. Just because it's so strange and confusing so we're probably going to start uh, interspersing some different games in here for you guys just to kind of break up the monotony of this same game over and over and over again so uh, be looking for uh, new let's plays of new games coming your way very soon <sighs> trying to think if there's anything else I'm forgetting no it's not be sure to click on subscribe if you haven't already I am the infamous Tony guys and I will see you in the next video bye bye Jeez!